Hi, this is George Cow, and there's my sweet little dog, Buddy. Okay. <laughs> He's such a good boy. Uh, so today, I want to talk with you. I, I just I had a couple of thoughts about winning the game of money. Do you wish that you could no longer have to obsess about money? Uh, no longer have to always feel like you're, you're in need? Well, I'll share with you a couple thoughts here that may be helpful for you. The first thought is it's incredibly important right now to figure out how much is enough money for you. One of the greatest um, sinkholes of money, especially online, is when you buy programs from business coaches like me um, or other kind of... Uh, people trying to help you make money and they just sell you on making more money so the message is always more money when that is a very destructive message because more money means you will never ever get there why is it that people who already make a million dollars a year are not satisfied and they want to now make 10 million dollars a year and people who make 10 million are not satisfied they want to make a hundred million dollars a year they have never have enough and so they keep obsessing about more 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 when in reality, so much of their energy, life force, time can be liberated to do so much more good in the world if they weren't so obsessed about making more money. So let's stop. Let's stop the madness now. Stop talking about making more money. Let's start. Let's say a lot more. We need, we need to hear this a lot more in our culture to make enough money. Because when you know what is enough for you, and I have some resources on this, as you might know. I've, I've done quite a few videos about money and even templates to help you figure out what is enough and how much to charge, all that stuff. When you know what is enough, you've won the game at the first level. You've won. You've won more than someone else who's still a billionaire but still keep pursuing because they don't feel like they have enough. So when you get to enough, I feel like every single day I feel a sense of well-being. Even though I, don't, I, make, less, I make a lot less money than I did before, I know what is enough and I have enough and I make enough. And I have the sense of well-being every day. So the first level is enough. Second level is to know that as you keep growing your character, and you might say your spiritual growth, the less you realize you need. So the higher your spiritual uh, growth and the more uh, happy you are regardless, because you, you've tapped into this inner, this deep vein of peace and contentment and joy that is everlasting, the more you get there, the more you habituate that, the less money you need in your life. Okay, this is amazing. So that's the second level of freedom, is to understand that and to pursue that. Um, the ultimate, you know, what, uh, what Jesus said, seek first the kingdom of God and everything will be given to you. That's sort of like the, the end point of that. But it takes time. It takes gradual spiritual growth to get to that point. But every level you achieve, you need less and less money. But it takes time. So you still need to make enough money right now for your level of spiritual growth. One of the mistakes people make is, oh my God, to be spiritual means I don't need anything. So I'm just going to sell everything, give everything away. And that's too drastic of a step. Do you understand? Because they're not there in their spiritual growth yet. They were idealistic and they sold everything and now they, they realize they're miserable because they're not there. They still feel like they need this or they need that. They are not. So take, give yourself that, 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 um, the, the, the ramp up towards enough spirituality where you can actually need a lot less than, than you do now. The third level of freedom, the third level of freedom is to know that no matter what, you will always be taken care of. That truly you are deeply, your soul, your consciousness is completely secure and taken care of. And that's the ultimate level of freedom. And so I wish that for you. And so take these three thoughts into account and see how you can integrate this into your money consciousness. I wish you well.